In this video, I will compare TDO versus Talk2 and tell you which of these chatbots and messaging platforms may be best for you and your needs. Now, Talk2 has a huge advantage, which is that it is free, unless you want to use their AI or you want to remove the Talk2 branding. Now, TDO, on the other hand, is not free. They do have a free plan available. I think that is for up to 50 conversations per month. So if you stay under that, then TDO is also free to use, but mainly it does cost money. So should you pick Talk2, which is free, or TDO, which is paid, and why? First, I'll quickly go over what exactly they do. So TDO, you can see, helps you accelerate your growth with AI customer service. So it has an AI chatbot, which you can see right here. It's called Lyro AI Chatbot, which claims it will help you win up to 70% of your team's time back. So you can automatically answer common questions and perform recurring tasks with AI. On top of that, you have live chat that you can add to your website, and you have a shared or unified inbox for a bunch of platforms, such as your website, first of all, but also WhatsApp, Instagram, Messenger, email, and a few more. Now you can also create a help desk where you can manage tickets and resolve issues, and you can set up flows. Now the main benefit to using Ethereo, in my opinion, is their integrations, and mainly the website integrations. So if you use any of these website builders that you can see right here, so WooCommerce, BigCommerce, Equid, Wix, Squarespace, WordPress, or Shopify, which are probably the main ones, then personally, I would very strongly consider using Tidio since it's very easy to integrate and especially if you do e-commerce. For example, I used Tidio with my Shopify e-commerce store and it's very, very good because you can see exactly what the customer has ordered, the status of their order. For example, if they ask why hasn't my product arrived yet, you can tell them exactly what the status of their order is and you can even give them a discount automatically for their next order and stuff like that. So basically, it's well make more money. Now the AI is also very easy to use. You can just upload a URL to your website and then it's going to extract all the data such as shipping times or opening hours and when somebody then asks about that the AI chatbot will just reply to that automatically. Then comparing this to Talk2, you can see they also have a live chat. You can create a knowledge base and Talk2 has even more. So for example they have contacts so CRM then chat pages, and then now they also have AI assist. But where Studio is mainly for customer service and basically replying to tickets, stuff like that, with Talk2 there are a few more things such as CRM and chat pages, and it's 100% free. Now, if you're wondering how they make money and basically why it's free, you can read that right here on their website and basically comes down to they are not the first to do it, the this kind of product. So they need to have some kind of distinction as for them that is to be free. And you can see the market share for Talk2 is the highest with over 20%, while Tidio has 5.44%. Now right here you can actually see that it is not free if you want a few certain things. So you can see right here if you would like to remove the Powered by Talk2 branding then they charge $29 per month. Now if you want to automate your live chat, so use their AI, then it will cost you another $29 per month. At least that's where it starts, it depends on how many conversations you want. And then third, if you want to get team members to basically reply to tickets and not use their AI powered bot, they have people that will do it for $1 per hour. Now comparing this to Tidio, you can see their pricing right here starts at 29 euros per month, but if you have less conversation, so 50, it's completely free. But let's say you have 200 conversations per month, then you can use it for 59 euros per month in the growth plan, which is the most popular plan. And the plus plan is for a lot more conversations and premium is pretty expensive as you can see, but this is for more complex businesses. Now you also get 50 Laro AI conversations, so you can scroll down and here you can see how much it costs. For example, if you want 50 conversations per month, it's 39 euros. And then for the flow visitors, you can also see how much that costs right here. So overall, Tidio is a lot more expensive than Talk2. So is it worth that money or not? 
In my opinion, if you're looking for a simple live chat option to add to your website, just like you can see in the bottom right, right here, and you're not necessarily looking for a really advanced tool, and you don't mind the setup taking a little bit longer than with Tidio, then talk to is a really amazing tool. Just in my opinion, it is best for smaller businesses. So if you have a smaller service-based business or even an e-commerce business, and you have someone on your team that can be online quite often, or you don't mind paying for their AI, or maybe you yourself can keep an eye on open conversations during the day, then I think talk to is a very good tool. However, Tidio is better in my opinion. Now that doesn't mean that everyone should use it, but if you have a larger business, or I would say if you have an e-commerce business, host it on any of the website builders that I showed earlier. So that includes Shopify, WordPress, Wix, WooCommerce, and a few other ones. And personally, I would go with Tidio because I do think that Tidio is going to help you get better customer service and actually also make more money with stuff like automatic discounts and improving the customer experience. Now you can see they have a special e-commerce section on their website. So low customer lifetime value isn't your fault, but you can do something about it. It costs you 10 times more to acquire new customers than to retain existing ones, ensure repeat purchases with AI driven e-commerce customer service software that refines every touch point in your buying cycle. So I would say for e-commerce, TDO is very, very strong and advanced, and I would definitely use it for that. Now, if you do want to get started with TDO, I'll leave a link to them down in the description where you can get a seven day free trial on their paid plan to test out all of their features. And you don't even need to enter any credit card details or anything like that. So go and click on the link in the description if you want to get started with TDO. But again, for many people, talk to is also a very good option if you have a lower budget and a smaller business. And if you don't mind spending some more time doing it yourself or using the talk to AI. So that concludes this comparison of TDO versus talk. If this comparison was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.